Yo, what's going on guys? It's Sam here, and I'm coming at you guys with a different style of video today. I'm, I'm going on a little bit of a rant video here, and I, I kind of want to clarify a couple things about the YouTube community, and at least, at least in the Minecraft world. And I guess what is a common misconception amongst a lot of different people and viewers in the community? I mean, at the end of the day, you're entitled to your opinion, but a lot of people are trying to back their opinion by facts that aren't really good facts. I, I don't know really what to how to explain that, but today I want to talk to you guys a bit about the quote paid promotions or sponsored videos that all you see on a lot of channels, including mine. I accept some of these. And I don't really understand why the community gets so negative about people about YouTubers that they watch and they like doing these things. The way I see it is that A a server gets more players. B, the YouTuber is better off because of said promotion. Like, they made money off of this promotion. They worked hard on a YouTube channel to get a big following, and now they're actually earning a lot from this following. And not only that, but these viewers are getting mad that they are seeing new content, and not only are they seeing new content, but 99% of the time, they're also going to have a new place to go play a new game type. I don't really see how anybody loses, you know? And yet, it has such a negative connotation to, uh oh, get out of here. Sorry about that, AMD drivers needed to, uh, AMD drivers needed to update, but again, it, it seems like a win-win-win to me. Servers get more players, uh, the YouTuber has more revenue because he worked hard, he slash she, I, it's 2016, I'm sorry. He slash she worked hard to get a following in which people want to promote their product on, and the viewers get a new place to play. Like, I, I don't see how anybody loses, so I'm really, really flustered about why this has such a negative connotation to it. Like, I'm gonna go through my comment section right now, and by the way, guys, people, like, I think some of the thing is that people don't realize that it's a sponsored video sometimes. People, if a video is sponsored or something like that is sponsored, any YouTuber is legally obligated to state their ties to that network, as in, I'm not sure if you guys heard about the whole T. Martin Syndicate kind of CSGO Lotto scandal that H3H3 uploaded. Uh, it's kind of mature content, so if you guys are younger, I wouldn't recommend watching it. But if you are older, and my guess is a lot of you all have heard about it, basically, they were actually owned, like, they actually owned a site they were betting on and gambling, although yeah, that's a whole other fiasco. And I, I, I actually like Syndicate a lot, so I'm not gonna... I'm not trying to bash on him. He's a great guy. He's done so many amazing things for this community that should not ever be ignored. But they did get into trouble because nowhere did they state their ties to the server. You are legally obligated to say, sponsored by XX, as you can see in my description, any video, guys, that is a promotion or a sponsored video, you have to disclose that somewhere. It needs to be disclosed. So if what I do is I always put that in the description, okay? So if you don't know if something's sponsored or not, just check the description and it's fine. Like you, you are legally obligated to know the ties to a server or any product that you are advertising. Like you have to disclose that if it's paid or you own it, et cetera, et cetera. So I'm kind of going to read through a little bit of these comments. I'm going to kind of rebut them. Now this guy, I just, I just kind of told him, I was like, you want to read the description? Like it's, it's right in the description. So he, he understood. In fact, it has a lot less stuff, which is, you know, an opinion. I don't really care about that. It's obvious they paid you. So please just be honest with us. And what I don't understand is this, this really has a negative connotation to it. So I was really, really confused and, uh, I didn't really know what to say to that. So I was just like, you want to read the description? It says sponsored by, that's that's pretty much it. And he comes down, he was like, he was like, you just kind of made it seem like you're acting and you weren't sponsored in the video, sorry. I guess, you know, I guess I could start saying it, you know, I, I will take some responsibility for that because it's not, it's not a fair assumption to assume everyone's going to read the description. But uh, yeah, so moving on. Then there's this one, which I guess could be taken either way. You know, like how much they pay you pay, like to play on their server, which it's not really that big of a deal. Nor I don't think I'm like I actually don't think I'm allowed to disclose that, but it's nothing. You guys are if you guys think we're getting paid like tens of thousands of dollars to do these things, you're crazy. You are crazy, man. And then this guy says, "You prisons, literally just sitting there." and holding down left click, how much money did you get paid to do this video? I don't really understand why people comment that stuff because at the end of the day, if you don't like something, don't watch it. 
you know like of course guys i'm always gonna upload content that you guys like i'm actually gonna be planning on doing a lot of double uploads this week and throughout the week i'm gonna the 11 days i'm gonna be gone at minecon and twitchcon i'm gonna have a lot of videos planned for that so i really am gonna get back on my upload grind it's just really hard balancing it with Mindplex games right now so i have a lot of work to do but i i just realized i need to put down a lot more hours to get this stuff done but look, I, I just don't see the need for comments like this, man. Like, and this is this is not just on my channel. This is throughout the community. There is the whole drama with like two chains and and like the trailers or whatever. Like personally, I think it's great he's uploading the server trailers. I didn't really care, but the community got really angry. And there's a lot of comments on a lot of YouTubers' videos that are paid promotions that people get really, really angry about. Like, why are you angry? You have a new place to play. Your YouTuber that you are subscribed to or that you watch is being supported and the server has good advertisement. Nobody loses. So why are you complaining? Like, the only logical thing I can come to is that you're jealous that these guys are getting paid to make Minecraft videos. Like, I, I just really don't get that, man. I don't know. I, I, I really feel like that's something that should change in the community. That's something that we are really doing wrong as a community. It's, it's just something I felt like I needed to address because I see this in my comment section and I really want to just kind of Ah, just like why because it doesn't make sense to me. It really doesn't make sense to me, you know And then how much money do you get paid to this video again? You know, not really that relevant. How much do you get paid? Sam's life is going downhill. By the way guys, I didn't actually get demoted. I resigned. That was a that was a joke I, I said that as a joke. I guess people read the comments without uh <laughs> Without actually watching the video. So uh, My goodness gracious and now he's going to prison. That was kind of funny. Um all right, this one is from Ben Fells right here. This is from Ben Fells, an old, old viewer of mine. I know him from a long time ago. This is not something you, first off, this is not something you would enjoy, Sam. Okay, Ben Fells, I love you, buddy, but you can't tell me what I'm going to enjoy in life and what I'm not. Why are you such a sellout in sponsorships lately? I'm a, I'll tell you this, and I will say this. I have gotten dozens of emails asking for sponsorships. I have probably only accepted under 25% of them. So I am definitely not a sellout. I have had dozens of emails to my business email saying, and I won't say who because that's not relevant. And I don't think, I think that needs to say private and confidential. That's kind of a business confidentiality. But I have denied over three fourths of sponsored videos. I have had networks come out to me and say, hey, will you do this for, for a paid promotion? This, And I have said no over 75% of the time because either A, I don't have the time to do it. B, I didn't really like the network or like, uh, I don't really like the game types. Or C, I just didn't want to do it. You know, guys, and, and it really irritates me to, like that people are jumping to these conclusions. Like, why are you such a seller? I'm not, dude, I'm the opposite. I literally deny 75% of my sponsored, <laughs> of sponsorship, like business side, like uh, proposals and stuff like that. I have denied over three fourths of them. And I don't know, I just, I really feel like that people are jumping to conclusions. Also this one. Also, why are you advertising servers in my Plex that has drugs? There's a reason why I didn't cover drugs too much in the video. Like each server can do what they want. And I wasn't not going to cover a server because of something like that. I still think the server is cool. I'm entitled to my opinion. And at the end of the day, if I choose to promote it, it's my channel, man. And just don't watch it, you know? Uh, it's obvious you were doing this just as a sponsorship. sponsorship. Again, read the description. I really recommend that you guys, if you guys think that a video is sponsored, read the description because legally speaking, it has to be disclosed. And now somebody can go to jail because they didn't put sponsored by XX in their description. No, but it is something that we should be doing as YouTubers. So moving on. Sam, okay, here's Ben Fels again. Sam, how come you are being sponsored by so many servers? And then there's this guy says a dollar, dollar, dollar. Uh, yes and no. At the end of the day, guys, like I am flying to California for 11 days. Uh, I am going to have bills to pay. I like you guys know, like I am not in school this semester. This is my job. Like this is what I really don't get about a lot of people is and I actually saw PewDiePie read this comment off. PewDiePie, you only do YouTube for the money. You're such a sellout and stuff like that. And then he said, this was his response, which I think was a, like a really great response. He said, I, wow, I must be the only one that works to earn money in this world. Like, guys, look, this is my job. I consider this my job. I have to earn revenue off it. Is that the only reason I do it? No. At the end of the day, I, I wouldn't do any of these things if I didn't love what I was doing. If I didn't like what I was doing, I would still be in school trying to find something that I love what I was doing. And now I am going back to school, BT Dubs. It's just a semester, so calm down, people. I see, I think Ben Fells was actually commenting on my engine while saying, you need to go back to school. I am going back to school. I am taking this semester off, though. So, yeah, that's kind of how the cookie's going to crumble here. But, uh... Yeah, I mean, dude, it's, I, I work for a living. This is my living. I'm trying to make a living off this while getting unique content, diverse content, 
and just content for you guys to have and showing you guys new places to play. Kind of appreciate the game for what it is and how like broad Minecraft can be. And I, again, I don't really see why this is a bad thing. I, I, and I hope a lot of these people can understand that. Like, this is not a bad thing for anybody. Nobody really loses here. And at the end of the day, if you don't like the video, you don't want to watch it, just don't watch it, you know? But there, you also have to understand there are people that do like this. So again, it's, it's really hard as a YouTuber to balance it between your audiences. But that being said, let's move on. <laughs> okay, I got a good laugh from this comment right here. I like this guy. I got a lot of respect for this guy, okay? This guy is straightforward. I like it. He says... It's pretty obvious that they paid you. Those features are nothing that most servers. Uh, those features are nothing most servers have. Those I don't really know because I really haven't even gone on the prison server in two years from before this. So I went on to this one and I liked all the stuff. So why wouldn't I play it? You know, there's nothing wrong with getting paid to do it. I'm pretty sure everyone in this comment section ranting on how they paid you. 100% would take more than thirty dollars just to record a video on a server. So everyone, shut up. I know you would take that money. I mean. I, th this is a pretty real comment. I got a lot of respect for this guy because he actually was straightforward about it. So there's nothing, he, I mean, he kind of shares my, my, like my mindset. There's nothing wrong with any paid to do a video. I'm pretty sure everyone in this comment section ranting on how they paid you 100% would we'll take more than just $30 to record a video on the server, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Moving on. By the way, guys, like, again, I don't make like a ridiculous amount of money off some of these. Like this, like, it's not crazy. It's really not crazy. So don't think it's crazy. That's what I don't want you to think. <laughs> I, I, I like this one. Samito D at JLGG. Nice, dude. Nice. Okay, here we go. This is one that really kind of just makes me face desk. Sam, you became a sellout. It's okay to do sponsored content, but at least don't deny that it is. That's just disrespectful towards us, the subs. Guys, again, I would never, ever, 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 ever mislead you like that. Again, it is in the description. Now, I guess, I mean, do I really want to start, do I really have to start saying that every video is sponsored actually in the video? I, I really don't want to do that because it kind of takes away from my commentary. Like, I'd be like, by the way, this video sponsored in the middle of every video. No, I don't want to do that. It's just in the description. Like, that's, I don't know, dude. Like, it's, what really makes me aggravated is people think, my subs think that I'm misleading them. I'm not, guys. It's every time it will be in the description, every single time a video is sponsored, it will be in the description. 100%, I want to comply with the law. I want to be straightforward with you guys. And I will always be straightforward with you guys, okay? <laughs> Again, I'm not. I've not become a seller. I've literally denied over three fourths of like paid promotion deals. So don't even worry about that. Please stop playing on these servers where you pay, where they pay you to play on the server. Again, I I really don't see what the problem with that is. Like, <laughs> would you guys? Okay, so by that logic, what if what if Mindplex paid me to do a video? Would you want me to stop playing on Mindplex because I was paid to do it? Like, it just this stuff just doesn't make sense, dude. Like, it, it really doesn't make sense. I don't really understand. Then Nazo comes in here, he says, OMG, OMG, drugs in a fictional blog game, guys, so bad. Seriously, why are people making such a big deal over this? I genuinely want to know. Now, that's all the comments I kind of want to read over today. Um, again, guys, like, I am still trying to learn how to balance Mindplex games, all these other series I have to do, all these other things with my normal upload schedule. And I'm real I just realized that I'm going to have to start putting in a lot more hours, guys. Like, I'm easily going to have to be putting in six to eight hours a day on just recording and editing. Like, it's gonna take me a very long time. And what really stinks is that Time Warner uh, cut my upload speed in half without telling me, so I had to call them back and sort that out. So I'm kind of like really, really, I'm not really struggling, but it's not easy for me to do what I do. And I know one, a lot of you guys wanna see a lot of these Mindplex series. And I'm going to continue to work on that. I'm just gonna have to put in a lot more hours and I'm worried my content will have a kind of a quality drop and that's what I've been kind of afraid of with a lot of stuff that's why I've been doing a lot more diverse stuff and other stuff I don't know I am gonna start putting in a lot more effort though because I've realized that I have to and in this case like there's no shortcuts guys there aren't any shortcuts for doing what I'm gonna do so I'm just gonna have to sit down for like six to eight hours a day and just grind guys it's just gonna be the grind and you know what I really love what I do and I think it's gonna be worth doing that so I'm really gonna start doing that and uh yeah guys again this whole paid promotion thing in the community it's really really misinterpreted and it really is starting to grind my gears how people freak out and say a lot of comments like this like we already we obviously know it's promoted like stop hiding it like i'm not hiding it, it just read the description man i don't know nothing against you guys like look i don't want you guys to think i'm chewing you out i'm not that's not who i am i oh, 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 oh. that's not who i am and that's not what i want to do to you guys i just want to make a point I want to make a point to have you guys, if you're really that upset, I want you to think about what exactly it is that you're upset about. Like, because nobody loses here. Really, nobody loses here. I, I So I really don't see the point about why this community gets so, like, amped up over a paid promotion. And then they see what a YouTuber do one paid promotion. They say, oh my God, you're a sellout. Hey, you have no idea 
what deals this YouTuber gets. You have no idea what deals this YouTuber has denied. You, if you don't know, don't make those assumptions. Just, just don't make those assumptions. Like people are calling me a sellout. I denied literally 75% of deals that are offered to me because A, I don't have the time or I don't like it, blah, 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 whatever the reason. So stop jumping to conclusions. Just really think about what you're saying. Really think about the points you're trying to make. And that is going to do it for the paid promotion rant. I don't know. I just feel like somebody needed to say this. I, I really love this community. Don't get me wrong. But we, when we're wrong, when we're wrong, we got to own up to it and try to become better because of it. That's it for today, guys. I hope you all enjoyed. That was the paid promotions rant. And uh, see you guys in the next video. Leave a comment down below with your thoughts. I, I, I will be answering these comments. I'm interested to see what people have to say to respond to this and kind of see the YouTuber's perspective on what's going on. And uh, yeah, peace.